Hi, morning. Hey, hi, morning, guys. Hi, hi. hi, welcome to Singapore. The school term has started and the campuses are now bustling with activities. Today, we'll be visiting four universities to hear from our youth and their ideas on how to integrate technology with nature, culture, and community. Let's go. Do you think that you are living in a smart city? Wow. Wow. Uh, why? Yeah, I think so. I think we are on the way, but we are not quite there yet. Singapore quite smart. Uh. If you can invent a tech gadget, what would that innovation be? And like holograms. There will be some flying taxis around Singapore soon. Singapore could move towards a more bike-friendly environment, like maybe start planning for cycling lanes, like bigger ones. So something that can maybe like help me to turn on and off the lights, or maybe optimize optimize some of the devices to use less energy. Thing in your house is connected to your smartphone to an app, and then you can just like check my AC is not off. I lock my AC. What is environmental protection to you? Like maybe using less plastic bags, reusable bags, like simple things can go a long way. Yeah. So for me, it's a lot about um, like waste, reducing waste consumption. Inventing perhaps a better trash system or more emphasis on recycling and separating certain items. So maybe let's do a spot check. Maya, can we check your bag? Or can I? Water bottles is fine. Oh, recycle bag. Yeah, recycle oh. yeah. <laughs> Wow. I got my trusty thing. Wow, that's really nice. Did you choose this colour? Uh, I don't know, I just found it at home, so <laughs> So as a tech company like Huawei, how do you think we can do it to make things more sustainable? You know, encourage consumers, if they have like bought a product from your company, then if they want to like switch to another product, probably they could like, you know, return the gadget or hmm. item. Businesses also can play a role in trying to reduce the packaging waste in order to protect the environment. Or would you like to share one unique culture? Uh, like the diversity of Singapore. Hawker culture is good for community building because it forces people in close proximity. We have so many different cultures here and we have so many different people bringing different ideas. If you could um, apply a technology to help uh, the less advantaged in the society, what would, kind of technology would you want to? We thought a while ago uh, of maybe perhaps people could carry a certain QR, especially elderly people, where it has some medical records. Some form of mobility technology, because as we can see in our campus as well, there are some places that are still very inaccessible. And I feel like if you have been injured and you need to move around school, then you'll realise, ah, we can do better with technology maybe. Today, we are glad to collect so many inspiring, innovative ideas and suggestions from our students. Stay tuned for more stories and details.